I know. That's fucking his girl's fault. We gotta make sure she's out of here next week. Yep. She doesn't give a fuck about any of them. Or... Well, I mean, you're technically supposed to play this game as, a, as an individual. Yeah. But I we mean, had all talked that we would have to start breaking down, making individual decisions after sequester because we'd have our votes. Right. You know what I mean? But her stunt last week, fucking stupid. They're like, oh, the floaters would have come after us anyways. I'm like, not Danielle. No way she would have unless she was felt scared. Doesn't matter. I had to take a hit sooner or later. You know? Yeah. It's too bad it's Kaser, but... Yeah, no shit. Just the way the cookie crumbles. And now, uh... The thing is, it's like... They're all upset that the way, you know, some of the people are acting to him now. You know, like the floaters, like Erica and oh, Marcellus. Marcellus. I'm like, I had this conversation with Kaser last night. I'm like, Kaser, you play the game one way, but your mistake all three times is that you want everyone else to play the game at that level. All three times. Which is the level of morality? Yes. I'm like, you can't, can't come to someone and tell them, okay, I'm going to play the game like this, so I expect you to play the same way because it's not going to happen. And it's going to, you know... I mean, maybe I go home fucked and I learn, but it's just... Nah, he... I mean, you can't play like that. It's... Unless you hook up with, like, the dastardly... I mean, the only way was, like, that guy Jason, you know, when he hooked up with Danielle. Yeah. But that was such a flukish thing. Right. Kaser could hook up with the, with the fucking evil guy. He had me. You know, he had yeah. Howie who was willing to play the game. But the weak link in our alliance was not Howie like we thought. It was Janelle running off on her own agenda. And, of course, giving away our, all our strategy to fucking Marcellus. Why would she do that? I don't know. I had a conversation with them. What's that snake? I had a conversation with them the first week, the four of us. And I was like, you guys, all the information we get, or I get, because I was getting information from Allison. I was getting information from fucking everybody. Uh-huh. And um, that's why I also went home instead of Danielle, because Allison told me that she's coming after um, Janelle, Kaser, and Erica. And I was like, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's not gonna happen. But um it's just like you guys we need to keep this shit between us. Our mis- one of our mistakes last year was Kaser gave away our strategy every chance he could because he thought it made him seem like a more like, yeah, like he wanted to garner respect by saying, Look, this is my plan. Right, right. No, it puts a bullseye on your back. So Janelle gave away our shit to Jace, she gave away and I she did it to Jace right in front of me. And I'm like Why Jace? I thought she didn't like him. I'm oh, like, because they were head of household together. Well, no, this was even this. Well, they still were head of household, yeah. But we were Janelle and I were playing chess, and she gives this information to Jason. I'm like, after he leaves, I'm like, why the fuck would you do that? If this Mr. And Mrs. Smith thing is true, he's gonna run right back to Allison. Mm-hmm. You know. And Diane. And Diane. And then remember up at the pool that day when um, the Mr. And Mrs. Smith thing came up. Yeah. And um, I had told Janelle that I heard from Nicole through you about Mr. And Mrs. Smith. Anyone out there? No, I'm just looking at the washer. And remember, and then the first thing Jace does, is like, she tells that information to Jace, and Jace is saying to you, oh, what's this about Mr. and Mrs. Smith? And you and I are having this conversation, and I want to be like, you motherfucker, you goddamn know well that like, we talked about this. Me and you. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, but, but I like, mean, it was totally speculative. I mean, I... Oh, of, of course. I but, I mean, I couldn't I just say that we talked about it. And I'm like, so that's the second time she threw my ass under the bus. Um, what was the third? Oh, the thing I was really pissed off about was when Case replied to me about his nominations and then told me if I want to do something, get an HOH. They love to say that. Yeah, so, I mean, That's but you don't tell that to your own fucking alliance. I know. So I give my HOH the next week. Um, I was all set to put Marcellus up. I wanted Marcellus' apps up so bad it wasn't even funny. Mm-hmm. You know? And it's like, they're like, no, we want Jace, majority, da 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 Jay said he was coming after Janelle and Danielle, so I figured, fuck, I could justify it. Next week, Janelle does whatever she wants against the wishes of Kaser. If you leave Marcellus around long enough, it's going to cause major, major problems yep. for somebody. Not to mention all the negativity, but one of those people that's so protective of him is going to fucking you know, <clears throat> end up getting fucked over and pissed off. Oh, what really lit me up was that I'm sitting there arguing with Jace. 
my chase the information that Janelle gave you in front of me. You went back to Allison. I walked into her room. She's when I sat down with her. She told me, you know what? Don't talk to me about the game because I know you're not on my side. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm like, I'm dead if she stays. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And I'm like, you gave her that information. You you're the her. only person Janelle and I told. And then Janelle's like, oh wait, I also told Marcellus. <laughs> so here I just went back against my word to Jace about not putting him up because he was coming after you and, and besides Jace had like nine alliances yeah apparently but it's like and now you're gonna tell me after the fact oh you also think you told Marcellus no you knew you told Marcellus you just lied to me and manipulated me to put up Jace you know because otherwise that would have been the thing that sent me over the edge to put up Marcellus so it's like, if you're going to lie, lie to the other team. Don't lie to your own alliance, mm -hmm. especially if you're going to suck at it. Just live it, man. Toss me around for a fucking month, knowing that they'll cut me loose first. Well, the beauty is they didn't really get a full chance to do that. Now you're in a good position. No, they you, man, really need you. You and Will need to really prove to Danielle, not prove, but show Danielle that you're here to play. Because that 24 hours of confinement probably sent that woman crazy. Yeah, I mean. And she's fucking mad as hell at I me don't, for getting that phone call. I don't throw anything. I don't fucking. I'm not going to be the guy that throws an HOH and then someone up there gets a bug up their ass to try and get rid of me and then I go home because I didn't try I won't live with myself if I do yeah. that yeah, this is Will's a different shot. story I don't know what he, what he's thrown and what he has in it. it's sort of like a weird thing it's like he's not the spider web obviously threw it but the other ones it's more like he couldn't be bothered right to like look at the pictures and study the pictures and you know focus well the thing is if he gets bothered and he looks at the pictures and he doesn't win then it looks like somebody here was smarter than him exactly Exactly. But he did, out of the blue, somewhat out of the blue, say to me two days ago, you know, I got to get focused on the HOH just because now it's getting down to the nitty gritty. He told me um, that he's going to win next week's HOH. Well, I, I like his determination, obviously. It's a one in, what, eight chance. It's a one in eight chance, but um, when it comes to actual intelligence here, there's very few people who actually have any. And, um, yeah, I mean, I hope the problem with the HOH is, is they're very little of, you know, but the way they're structured with the one and done, you know, the elimination thing. That's why I love the veto that I had because it was a three question thing. Yeah. Well, it was still one and done, but it was, you had, you had to win by getting three. So someone can't beat you just by answering one thing. Right. That's what I hate about head of households. Well, we could have a crapshoot this week, man. We could be rolling a ball down a, yeah. down a hill. True. True. I think about Will. If Will can memorize every freaking nerve center in the body. I agree. I agree. You know, he can walk around a house and realize that there's 22 Florida leases, you know? Is that true? Yeah. <laughs> what are those, the wall sconces? No, those are little, like, flower oh, yeah, black yeah. things. I thought you meant the, the lights on the wall. No. But there's around 1,700 bricks in the house. You know what I mean? Don't tell me you've counted the bricks. I haven't. One of my fucking Rain Man house guests have. Danielle? Howard. Howie counted the bricks in the house? What a freak. They asked me that, I'm gonna be like, fuck you, Julie Chen. But see, that's Good morning, house guests. The veto ceremony will begin in two Nine. hours. Mm. Let's see, that's dedication. Yes or no? Yeah. Do you really think someone's going to ask that? No, but that's not the point. The point is you have people who are willing to count every brick in the house, and you have other people who drop off a spider web within 30 seconds. Sure. Mm. If we can get HOH this we, week, yeah, we definitely especially have to. you guys, we have we, to get it this week. It's unreal, because we can do whatever we want, and our alliance cover will not be blown. The yeah. moment I have to turn, if I get HOH this week and I have to put up Janelle, it's pretty much blown because right. no, the best case scenario I have a target on her. Best case scenario would be for one of us to win it. And 